moved out to California to act uh, seven years ago when I was 12. I moved out here with my mom. Uh, I've been really fortunate so far. I'm about to start my third series. Trip, you're gonna have to hurry. I can't hurry. This thing is hard to crack. It's got a defense. It's got a defense system locked into it. I've never had any kind of experience like this, and it's all so new. Every day is like, oh, we're building this, we're doing this, da 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 da. So the whole, I, you know, this whole thing has been incredible. You know, the basic principles of what you're doing are still there, and once you get into a scene. You're in it with that person, but early on in the first couple days, Andy told me that that mocap acting is a bit more like theater acting because your your facial expressions do have to be so pronounced. You really have to focus on on the movement. I mean, effectively, you're animating a character that you know is not endowed with all of the range of motion that Lindsay is. You know what I mean? And you have to really make sure that all of that plays, and there's like a particular stance that they always take, and you have to be very body aware, obviously. Um, and you really are, are able to build the character from from her physical movements as well, which has been really fun. Your whole goal is the gameplay, but we tried to really bring that dramatic element in every single scene so that the, the, the tension would be very real between them and the emotion would be very real. You get so hot in that suit even after you've been doing the, the smallest amount of movement. Okay, I'm gonna need a few minutes to grab this. You know, you're running around for these big chase scenes and your adrenaline is up and you're getting shot at and you have to be really you know, in it, and you just get done and you're like, oh, I, I don't know what I'm gonna do.